welcome back to Midwest Access. We have to answer our question of the day. Yeah, so uh, we do this a hundred times, or the average person does it a hundred times a year. It's a good deed. A good deed. That's great. That's, that is a good one. Yeah. Yeah, we should be doing more good deeds than just a hundred. Yes, 365 good deeds, deeds a, a year. year. Sounds good to me, or even more. Okay, so I'm actually live on Facebook Live, so if you have Facebook, you're going to see the behind the scenes view of Steeplechase. We're out on Steeplechase. They are continuing to groom the area here and then oh he got he got it running for us too oh good perfect yeah, I actually Justin. tripped the wire <laughs> he, so, he let so me control the, yeah, lift, the lift and did, it was a fail didn't go well <laughs> it was a fail so we're gonna do a few more uh runs here we're gonna be out here i think through the five and six yeah we're here at five six o'clock here tonight so live weather we'll probably interview justin a couple times yes. it's a big opening weekend for them coming up this weekend they'll be open next weekend just after thanksgiving so everyone all full from that Thanksgiving dinner. You can come out here and do some tubing afterwards. Yeah, he's afterwards. expecting because it's supposed to be warmer a little bit next week. Yeah, next week we're we're not we're not ten outside, right. right? So it'll be like twenty eight to thirty two. I feel like that's although he said that's not good snow. No, it's not weather. good for snowmaking, but that's why they've made a lot, a lot of the snow lately. now, and yep. they're hoping it'll stick around and it will be perfect for Thanksgiving. But also this weekend, as early as ten o'clock tomorrow, we do have uh, the prices and the times on our website. That's kttc.com. Just click that Midwest access tab and you come on out to steeplechase invite your friends and family and have a good time it's really really yeah, fun it, out here and it's just a short drive from rochester what about 15 minutes yep. uh also i want to point out these tubes cami they're really nice yeah they the got bottom the need of them, for speed yeah the bottom of them they're nice and sturdy you fit right in um i'm wearing my hat funny because i'm showing off my new logo oh here. the m um, the new twins oh you can't see it there you, there you go. Let us know also on Facebook what you think of the new Twins uniforms, the new um, hats they have. Uh, some uniforms have the M with the star, the North yeah. Star mm -hmm. on top. Mixed reviews. A lot of people online aren't liking it. Well, it resembles the Miami Marlins it does. a lot. Yeah. The M, the M re but reminds who's me. who's thinking about the Marlins? They're not very no good. No one in the AL. They're not That's, very good. Well, they're not. <laughs> <laughs> they, they really aren't. Uh, but that that was my first, uh, being a baseball fan, that's the first thing that popped into my head. But I like the color. It's yeah. not, it's kind of a cream color. The yeah. hat's a cream yeah, color. Yeah, like a grayish cream. Yeah, I like it. So, okay, I like it too. I had a very fun time. It was very fun to chat with Luisa Rise and Jorge Polanco. Oh, man. And what a day for Cami Raisler today, right? It was amazing. Right? We're going to share, let's share on Monday. I'll share a couple other clips because you know I had some different oh. questions for them. I can only imagine what your questions <laughs> so would <fun>. be. <laughs> She's so, so excited. So, anyway, that was fun today. And Do you want me to hold the phone? Yeah, can you hold that? We're on Facebook Live. And the twins also traded. Oh, Gio Urshela Gio, my guy, Gio Urshela. Yeah, former Yankee. Yeah, so and he's going to the uh, L.A. Angels. Angels. Angels, yes, the Anaheim Angels. All right, let's get one final look here at the groomer. They're doing a lot of hard work out here at Steeplechase just outside of Rochester. You can come check it out this weekend. The runs open up tomorrow morning, so we're going to finish here, of course, with another We're going to go down, two. Justin. Is that all right? Hill. Don't unhook it, son. Try to duck it yes. out and grab it. That's what I did last time. But other, no, but so just like if you hit the trigger, so you kill the flow. But otherwise, you just uh, shoot back down and start it up. Hey, thanks for having us out here. We've had we've had a blast. Hey, thanks for coming out. This is kind of the fun part for us, honestly, is getting it all ready, and that's where most of the work is done behind the scenes. Versus the day of the tubing is just everyone enjoying it, having fun. But yeah. we actually, you know, behind the scenes is kind of the probably the more complicated, neater part of the whole operation. And just to reiterate, people can bring their own food out here if they want a snack or something because you don't have food out here right now. Yes, correct. We might try to get some stuff figured out later this winter or some food trucks, but right now you're welcome to bring food and snacks out and drinks and just kind of, you know, some people do tailgating and make an afternoon of it. Some people try to tube really quickly and get back into the warm, uh, inside yeah. warm. So, yeah. Okay, a lot of fun to be had out here at Steeplechase. We're looking for another good season. They had a good year last year. Yep. Is he coming? Yeah, he's gonna come. All right. Thanks again for joining us on Midwest Access. We hope you have a great weekend, and we will see you on Monday. Well, I'm trying to put this Facebook Live on here too. All right. So we have 30 seconds. Are we ready, Cammy? We gotta do a three, two, one. All I right. feel like I'm going over this cliff. Already. All right. You ready? All right. In three, two, Nick. one. Okay. Um. Oh, this is so bad. Have a great weekend, everyone.